हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू अ न्यू क्लास ऑफ वर्चुअल लर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स कैन यू टेल मी व्हाट आर द डिफरेंट पर्पजेज फॉर विच वी नीड वाटर यस यू आर राइट वी नीड वाटर टू ड्रिंक टू बेथ टू वॉश क्लोथ्स टू कुक फूड एंड फॉर मैनी अदर पर्पजेज टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न ई वी एस वन लेसन नंबर फाइव वॉटर फॉर एवरी हाउस होल्ड स्टूडेंट्स वी नीड वॉटर ऑल द टाइम वी स्टोर वॉटर इन द हाउस सो दैट वी कैन गेट इट वेन वी नीड इट अर्लियर ब्रास कॉपर एंड अर्थन पॉट्स वेर यूज टू स्टोर वॉटर नाव डेज वी यूज स्टील सिंथेटिक एंड प्लास्टिक टैंक्स टू स्टोर वॉटर care of drinking water to ensure good hygiene we must have safe drinking water if we consume contaminated water it can cause disease so we have to take special care of the water that we store for drinking and cooking for that keep the drinking water containers covered use a dipper to take water from the pot have a tap on the container of the water wash the container well before refilling it when the water in a container is finished we have to wash the container well before refilling it if we take such care drinking water remains clean children do you know water never becomes stale मतलब पानी कभी भी खराब नहीं होता सम पीपल बिलीव दैट द प्रीवियस डेज ड्रिंकिंग वॉटर मस्ट बी थ्रोन अवे बिकॉज इट बिकम स्टेल बट दिस इज अ मिसकॉन्सेप्शन इफ वी थ्रो दैट वॉटर इट विल गेट वेस्टेड इफ इट गेट्स डर्टी ड्यू टू सम रीजन वी शुड यूज दैट फॉर अदर पर्पजेस children using pipes we can distribute water stored in one place to several different places at the same time large cement or plastic tanks are installed on the roofs of big buildings with the help of pipes the water is distributed to kitchens toilets and bathrooms of different houses taps are fitted on the pipes to turn water on and off children let us learn about distribution of water there are two steps involved in this process from the source to water tower water is rain water is collected in sources it means in lake rivers after that that impure water is brought into purification plant after purified after that purified water is sent to water tower a large water source means lake river or reservoir is identified near a settlement water is brought from it through large pipes to a water purification plant here purification of the water is done to make it safe for drinking purified water is then pumped into water towers second step is from the water tower to our houses the collected purified water is sent through big and small pipes in buildings and houses this is the second step water towers water tanks at a height water towers are used to store purified water this water tanks are at a height water flows downwards water is pumped up to these tanks using machines called pumps water is supplied from the water tanks to towns and cities journey of water from source to house students in the previous slides 
you all have seen how water is distributed two steps are involved in this from the source to water tower and from water tower to our houses this is the compilation of both the steps children rain water is collected in the source after that it is sent to purification plant after that it gets purified it is stored in water tower children why is the water pumped it cannot climbed it flows downwards for that we need to pump it journey of water from source to house rain water is collected in the source water is brought into purification center then the purified water is stored in water tower arrangements are made to distribute this water all over the town or city children do you know potable water is an expensive substance yes water purification storage and distribution requires electricity and diesel to run the machines and also a lot of manpower a lot of money is spent in this hence it is an expensive process we therefore have to pay for the water that we use means our water bills therefore we should not waste water so children use water without wastage we can follow these small small things to save water use a bucket to have bath instead of the shower while brushing teeth turn the tap off after washing vegetables and fruits use the water to water plants do not turn the full tap on while washing things students what have we studied in today's video different containers to store water water distribution to the houses and how to use water without wasting it so students water should be stored properly and used carefully we must take care of water just as we take care of our other valuables thank you